OK, here's question 8C, as a continuation of the 8A and B. Using the trapezium for the, for the earlier part of the question, um, we are asked to put them together to make a regular shape. And then we need to know how many of those are required to make that shape. And we're actually asked to work out how many exterior sides does the shape have. And you must show you're working. So, looking at this trapezium, um, this shape is going to be a polygon. The most uh, straightforward way to think about polygons and angles is, uh, well, not the, probably the best way to work things out with polygons and angles, is to look at exterior angles of polygons. That's not always the case, but uh, usually. Um, it's best to work with the exterior angles. So, if we've got our trapezium turned around so it makes this shape here, then this angle here, we've worked from our diagram, is 75 degrees. This angle here is also 75 degrees. So that's 150 degrees in total. This is a straight line, so that angle in there is going to be 180 minus 150, which is 30 degrees. So if the exterior angle of our polygon is 30 degrees, that means that there are 306, 360 divided by 30 of those angles which is 36 divided by 3, which is 12 uh, angles, and therefore there must be 12 sides of this polygon.